My god, let's move on into the actual video. Today is gonna be a little bit of a shorter one because uh, it's not like I, it, I don't have the world at my hands. What? It is not about too much stuff. It, it's just two things that I bought, but the two things uh, is a little bit, I guess, I'm gonna go get the things now, and then... All right then, so, all right. Here are the two things that I bought at the place I'm not gonna pronounce because you can't say it in English, but there it is real quick. They were on like really good sale prices. It's this like blazer thingy right here from design remix that's not something i've heard of, heard of before like both of these things that i'm going to show you right now it's not things that i've heard of before so uh i'm sorry if uh, i'm a little bit ignorant in that sense but this is made by um Charlotte Eskilsen which uh is probably danish I would presume and it's designer remix what I found like really cool about this one is like the color of the suit and the fact that it is a suit usually a lot of the time right suits are incredibly expensive like if they're upscale type uh, brands and this one used to be $500 I got it for uh, 50 which is kind of nuts actually the material that it's made out of is like recycled so it's like old textile but then or like textile that has been used and then sent away i guess and then reused again which is good because you know it's good for the environment and stuff like that and um it has this really cool like singe detailing on the back uh which sort of gives you broader shoulders maybe or i don't know but it's really cool uh, it wasn't that great when it was like with the stuff I was wearing at the time in the store when I tried it on. But I really like the color and I think I can style it with a lot of different things. So anyway, next item. This is by far my favorite item that I got. And it is these corduroy pants that are flared. I've always wanted a pair of flared pants and the fact that they're corduroy is just like a plus. And well, for us that don't have the money to uh, just buy every single season of uh, Gucci, this is pretty good. Cause uh, this one used to be $200. I got it for like $20, I think, which again, it's like, <laughs> Holy, but uh, I guess just nobody wanted them or they didn't fit them or something. I don't know But on me, I feel like they're like absolutely tailored almost even to me, I guess <laughs> Most likely this is gonna be like my new favorite pant because it goes with like absolutely everything I can wear boots with it. I can wear um, The triple s with it that I did a video on earlier click that over there if you want or uh, don't but I really love these two things I might be able to uh, style them both together in this video I don't know I'll try I guess I'm gonna be styling a couple of outfits in both of these two pieces and then we'll be right back here after that let's go
Okay guys, I'm so sorry about my incredible unprofessionality here. I uh in, in the previous before the B, before the B-roll, I uh lost my other uh coffee cup, so here here's another one. That's a little bit larger. <coughs> anyway, weren't uh, weren't those outfits sort of like uh Litty on a stack, no cap, all facts, no printer, new freezer. Huh? But yeah, I'm pretty sure the, these pants might be my new favorite pants. Let me get them out here again. Laser and the pants. Also, still, I'm very terrible when it comes to professionality because uh, I didn't name the brand of these pants. They're the Munthi, I think. That's what it says, but I don't know what that means. Uh, heartbreak pants. Autumn Winter 19. Camel. That's, that's the brand and the, the model and everything. Like that. And to be honest, I'm incredibly happy with these two pieces. It's like... They work perfectly. You can actually wear them together without it seeming odd, even though they are very contrasting hues of color, right? Brown versus pastel green turquoise. Both of these pieces, right? They're actually women's wear. Would you believe it? And um, the place I went to to buy these things was just women's clothing, right? And the place where these pieces were, they were in like a pile that I guess is stuff that just didn't sell uh, that they were trying to get rid of, right? And um, so I bought them. Yeah, and that's the story of that person behind the counter sort of looked at me a little bit weird like uh, didn't really give me a vibe that they thought that I was buying for myself and uh, you know sometimes when you go to a store and the store clerk says uh, hey you know this is the women's section right you know what you should do you should just be like oh look at the time okay maybe maybe don't do that but you know, it's 2021, right? You can wear whatever you want. If it's women's wear, like, let's put it into perspective, right? If you say no to women's clothing, right? And you're a guy or whatever, and the clothing fit you, then you're technically just saying no to a bunch of styles that you would most likely, if you go to a higher higher fashion brand right then all of a sudden you have to pay like five thousand dollars for the same clothing item you could have paid what like three hundred dollars for instead right and to me that's just like yeah there might be some quality differences but when it comes to like from like mediocre fashion or like the mid-tier fashion to high fashion there's not like that much quality difference in my experience so you know you're just sort of like limiting yourself style wise of what you can wear in my opinion and um, you know it's 2021 man or woman or other wear what you want to wear and uh, if somebody says uh, you can't then fuck them do this Give him, a, give, him a, give him one of these. And on that note, I think this will be where I end the video. If you liked the video, then uh, be sure to leave a like, comment down below what you thought of the clothing pieces. And, uh, well, um, if you want to see more of my videos, then uh, you could click a couple of them somewhere on my channel there might be one right here that's coming up and then the subscribe over here uh, anyway love you guys see you peace out <laughs>